Hey, what's going on? Welcome back to another part of reviewing Blue Stack Productions. So last part I covered episode 3 of Real Figures and this part episode 4 will be covered which is called Hello Neighbor. And yes, it is the exact same title as the horror indie game. The episode starts off with Soap noticing a new neighbor that's moving in the neighborhood. Inside the house, the neighbor is bored because he doesn't have any friends to hang out with. But he heard a knock at the door and turned out it was Soap who was at the door, so they shook hands. Meanwhile, Kyle is watching Soap conversating with Mark. Eventually, he went over to Mark's place himself to make sure he is following his plan. Kyle confirmed Mark is going according to plan, but after Kyle left, Mark said he has a plan too. I have no idea what that means. I literally don't. I don't know where I was going with this. Later at the house, Steve asks Soap who is his new friend, then walks off as Soap tells him who he is, like, why did you even ask in the first place? Then we get into this mysterious place hearing another mysterious voice once again. Someone is claiming to have some kind of power just like the red and blue eyed character. Turns out it's this weird bearded guy in a gray background. Back at the house Dan is thinking about something which caught Mason's attention. So he asked him what's wrong but he was supposed to be at a concert at that time. Mason said he got hybrid and went overdrive which makes no sense. But I think you guys get it. Dan tells Mason he thinks a demon is the reason why he's separated from his biological family as he remembers seeing a demon when he was a baby. Feeling overwhelmed, Dan runs off leaving Mason behind as he's feeling sorry for Dan. At the neighbor's house, Soap decides to get nosy so he lets himself enter Mark's house to find a green light flashing from the open basement. As Soap is eavesdropping, Kyle says that Mark must kill every one of Dan's friends. After hearing this, Soap leaves back to his house to warn his friends about what he saw and heard from the neighbor's house. Soap describes seeing a demon which triggered Dan to remember the same demon he was thinking about earlier. Soap notices Dan reacting to what Soap said so he asked Dan if he had anything to say about it. It seems like Kyle knew Dan but Dan said no. So Soap handles the situation by calling the police and telling everyone they're safe, making Mason ask if Soap was serious about it. And that's the end of the episode. The episode's wingdings message translates to who is the black slash green demon and the ARP question asked have you ever been suspicious over your neighbor's behavior? Well, no, I don't really talk to my neighbor, so I don't really care what they do. So that was episode 4, Hello Neighbor from Rainbow Figures. It was released on April 25, 2020. Yeah, that does it for the fifth part of reviewing the Blue Stack production series, and episode 5 will be revealed in the next part. If you guys enjoyed the video, please make sure to leave a like and consider subscribing. Also, thanks for watching, and until next time, see you around.